What's going on everybody? Hope everybody's doing great today. Today I want to take a little bit of time and answer some questions that I've been getting on my channel quite a bit and that involves uh, details about my direct mounting system that I use for my rifle tripod setups. Over the years, I've done a lot of shooting just off of a simple bipod or a monopod. But here over the last couple of years, I've went with the full tripod setup. Uh, I'm using a hog saddle tripod. And I'll make this real easy for everybody. I'm going to put links to everything that I use down below in the description. That way you guys can go there, take a look, see if it's something you guys might be interested in buying. Um, but back to my setup, uh, using a hog saddle tripod. And then I'm using a Markins ball head. And this right here, you will notice it has the quick release system on the top. And just want to take a few minutes here, kind of go through two different setups that I use. And we'll get right into the first setup that I use. And that is this dovetail plate or Arca Swiss plate. And this one that I'm using is made by Really Right Stuff, RRS. So what this does is you'll loosen up this quick release system, open that, and these dovetails slide right in, clamp that down, and just a quick safety check, make sure we're dealing with the clear weapon. All clear. And then you can see that this gives you full flexibility to get on target then when you're on your animal or your target just screw the tension knob down now you can go hands free so the really nice thing about this dovetail mount or Arca Swiss plate uh, is just the fact that it's it's very rigid because this is an M-lock can guard so this is an M-lock plate well they make it for key mod or M-lock but it's just very sturdy, very solid because it's a direct mount to your handguard. So I really like this setup just because it is a direct mount, uh, a little more rigid than this other one that I'm going to show you. But uh, the other one is a much cheaper option, I think. I think I paid $55 to $60 for this Arca Swiss or dovetail mount. And, you know, if you're starting to spread that across three, four, five, 10 15 rifles whatever you might have that's going to add up pretty quick so i'll jump right in here show you what i've been using here recently just so i can kind of spread that and use that over a variety of different rifles instead of buying a plate for each one so we'll go ahead and take this off here and my other option that i've been using recently is also made by hog saddle this is actually called a pig saddle uh, rifle tripod mount or shooting rest but they make this pig saddle here which is a little less quality than their I guess upper tier which is called a hog saddle rifle rest uh, but what this does is as you can see here this big clamp your rifle just sets right inside here so the way this comes from the factory whenever you buy this is without this dovetail plate right here or Arca Swiss plate so I bought this plate which allows me to attach it directly to my ball head to give me more flexibility and movement. Otherwise, you're gonna be taking this, there's a threaded hole here on the bottom, and you would be taking it and threading it directly to the top of your tripod. So it would set, without this plate on here, it would set directly on top of here and you wouldn't have the flexibility with the ball head. So we'll put the ball head back on. So you just take the pig saddle with the dovetail mount or Arca Swiss plate, set it right inside of the quick release system, tighten that down. And then you'll notice the lever here on the pig saddle. Just open that up, which opens up this channel. Grab your rifle, set it right inside there, 
Take this and clamp it down. Just to let everybody know, I am dealing with a clear rifle. And this option gives you a lot of range of movement as well. And just like the other direct mount method, get on target. Screw that down. And you're ready to shoot. And it clamps in there pretty tight too. You know, you can angle it down. Just like that. And it's going to stay in there hands free. So like I mentioned, just wanted to do a quick rundown on that. I know it's a quick run through, but if you guys have any questions, make sure and drop a comment down below. Like I mentioned earlier, I'll put a link to everything that I've used uh, in this setup. It might not be exactly what I used in this setup, but it's going to be very similar and it's going to get you a good idea of what you can buy. that allows you to get a setup like this that suits your needs, however you're going to be shooting or whatever you need for your rifle, whether it be a clamp type system or a direct mount like I showed you on the other rifle there. As always, appreciate you guys watching. Make sure and let me know if you have any questions. Make sure and subscribe to the channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Stay tuned for more and happy hunting. Be safe. See you guys. Bye.